From HD Studio One, this is NBC5 News. A popular North Texas water park is being sued tonight right before school is let out for the summer. A former visitor to Hurricane Harbor says she was badly injured on one of the park's attractions and that the problem has not been fixed. NBC5's Brett Johnson is live at Hurricane Harbor with the story. Brett? Well, Jane, she had no reason to fear for her safety when she jumped on the slide, but now her life has been changed forever. I came off this slide right here. It was supposed to be a fun day at the water park, but it has turned into a painful nightmare for 36-year-old Nancy Maxson. It's been horrible. Um, this is my second surgery that I've been through, and now my foot is fused where I won't be able to move my ankle ever again. These pictures tell the crippling tale of Nancy's injuries. She's now suing Hurricane Harbor after breaking her foot last July on a slide called Atlantic Panic. Somehow I went sideways and hit right here in between these buoys, and that's where I broke my ankle. Hurricane Harbor has since repaired the slide, but an expert hired by Nancy's lawyer tells NBC5 it's an improvement on what existed, but not enough to be as safe as it could possibly be. It still has the potential to create an entrapment point. You know, some better safety procedures should have been taken on their part. But the expert admits there's no way to know if the slide still poses a risk. Quote, there's no way to predict if any more injuries will occur. A million people could ride it without another incident, but there's still a potential hazard. And this is by far the worst thing I've ever gone through. And a spokesperson for Hurricane Harbor declined to comment on pending litigation. Reporting live, Brett Johnson, NBC5, Arlington. Thanks, Brett.